We all want to take care of our planet, and truly even small changes can make a big difference. So with tips on everyday zero waste essentials from the blog The Healthful Model is Hannah Larson, no relation that I know of, but we could be. <laughs> could be. We don't know for sure. <laughs> what made you come up with this list? Um, this list was just basically the things that were in my bag, and it's things that I've gone through over the years, and I'm like, oh, I'm really using a lot of water bottles when I'm flying or I'm traveling, and I basically just went out and got replaceable items for the items that I use the most. Right. Sometimes yeah. we don't, we're just not conscious. If we're not think thinking about, about all it. the, you know, the iced teas that you buy at Starbucks yeah. or all, all the water bottles, that's the big thing, or yeah. the straws or whatever. We can replace that stuff. Yeah, we can. And it makes a huge difference. So um, just take me through some of the examples. I'm sure people can Relate. Sure. So this here, this is um, a reusable produce bag. So it would replace like the plastic or the paper bags that right. you get at most supermarkets. Okay. Um, they're really lightweight. You can throw them in the washing machine, and it's just a really simple trick. It's like a. It feels like a little mesh bag, almost like you'd think of a delicate laundry yeah, bag. Yeah, exactly. So you can use this over and over again. Throw mm -hmm. it in the washing machine, and there goes all that, the baggies, the right. saran wrap, all that exactly. stuff. Exactly. Yeah. Great suggestion. And then this, of course, is a reusable tote, and we all have a million of them you know, laying around our never house. When I'm, almost never when I'm at the grocery store. I feel like I need to like tape that to my to head. head. Where do you put it so that you've got it when you need it? So I'll either stick it in the console of my car mm -hmm. or another trick I have for these things when you're kind of learning to implement them is put them near your phone because we never forget our smartphone. True. So if you're putting your cell phone in the console of your car because we're not texting and driving of course and you put your bag next to it it's really easy to remember you're grabbing both. Or on the doorknob or, or in your trunk. Knob, but yeah. yeah. All those good intentions. I get to the store without it too many times. I'm mm -hmm. going to do better about that. Yeah. yeah. Um, now, these things are really interesting because not only does this keep you from getting stuff that just goes in recycling or right. worse yet, sometimes just ends up in the trash. Right. Um, but they actually keep things hot and cold, so it's mm -hmm. an improvement over those materials. Yeah, it is an improvement. And again, like I brought all three examples. Um, it's great to put them in your day bag for work or your handbag. Um, if you know you're not going to be needing like your water bottle and your hot beverage container and your cold beverage container. It's about really taking what you know you're going to need for that. Day. I know I need my coffee. I'm not leaving without my. <laughs> I'm not, leaving I'm not going that. anywhere without this. As a true Seattleite, yeah. So I, I always like have that on hand. Um, this is great. I know smoothies are really popular right now. Mm -hmm. Juices and those also come in plastic containers, and so it's a great alternative to have that on hand. And you just give it to the person. And you just who's give it to the person. Drink, and they, yep. they can do that. Yeah. Um, and so a, a quick question about these: Are there also collapsible models? Because I feel like I it, sometimes want to take something and just stick it in my purse, but I don't have room for these things. I know there is a, a material that is like a flat water bottle. Mm -hmm. I haven't seen it for a hot beverage container, but that's something worth looking into. Yeah, well, yeah. I only, I don't really yeah. drink hot drinks yeah. that much, so that's okay. <laughs> that would be good for me. And then why, why these things? Okay, so food containers. These are great, of course, for bringing your lunch, so you're not bringing, you know, right. things that you're disposing of. But another trick that I like to have is to keep a clean one in my bag. So if I know I'm going to a restaurant where there's going to be leftovers, I can put them in there, there and then it's easy for lunch the next day. Right, exactly, yeah. and it doesn't, you know, get spilled in your car right. or whatever. So those are pretty simple. And I mean, I know there's some good ones, but mm -hmm. also just in the dollar aisle in the, oh, the drugstore, yeah. they have tons of these things that are perfectly serviceable. Exactly, and it doesn't really matter exactly what material you're using as long as you're reusing it. That's right. the key. Just make sure you do that. Yeah. And then I did not know what these are. Tell me, first of all, they're very pretty. Yeah, these are little uh, reusable Ziploc bags. So you can use them the same way that you would um, use your, your classic Ziploc yeah. bag. I use them for, for lunch or snacks um, when I'm on the go, but I also use them for my airport toiletries when I'm Excellent flying. idea. Yeah. Excellent yeah. idea. Okay, yeah. I should know about this. This one's called Full Circle, the brand. Where, mm -hmm. do, where do we get these? Or I just got these at PCC. At PCC, yeah. and then uh, do, can you put them in the in the dishwasher? They are dishwasher safe. Yes. Oh, that's awesome! So yeah. I can just put really this down in a rack. And all right, yeah. I'm sold on that. And then you have something called bees wrap. What is this? Yeah, so bees wrap is actually um, just a replacement for your classic saran wrap or plastic wrap. Um, so it's something that you can reuse over and over again for up to a year as long as you're washing it properly and storing it properly. That is such a good idea. I'm gonna, yeah. we're gonna put a list up later. Yes. There's some other things mm -hmm. um, that you've talked about, including cutlery. Is mm -hmm. that what this is? Yeah, so that's a, just a little reusable uh, cutlery pouch. So it comes in that little pouch and then inside is just a, your classic fork, knife, spoon, and then a pair of chopsticks. And okay. those also can just go inside the dishwasher. Can I open that up? And yes, I think please I feel do. The, here it is. 
the These straw, straw that you can have yourself and yeah. you just put this in your purse. It's no biggie. Yeah, it's no biggie, and it, uh, it straws have been in the media a lot lately because yeah. of Starbucks ditching their classic green straws for the sippy style cup. And uh, to sort of reiterate on that, um, so plastic does not biodegrade. It actually just breaks down into microplastics, which also infiltrate our water systems. They end and up in the ocean. They end up in our food supply. So yeah. it's better to just have something that's reusable. Right. Yeah. And uh, I mean, this one's metal, which is cool. You yes. can stick this in the dishwasher too, You can too, stick right? that in the dishwasher. Yeah. Now, is there any problem with when you have your own containers for cleanliness sake is are there businesses that aren't going to accept those when you hand them to them is there I haven't run into that problem um, in the city um, I'm going to a lot of the same places every day so mm -hmm. I'm not usually venturing out too much but for the most part I found that when you bring your own cup or your own uh, bottle it's more of a conversation starter than anything yeah. people are really interested in why you're bringing your own this is cool. I didn't realize these were all wood, so yeah, this is very lightweight. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So if you want to take it like on the airplane or something yeah. like that, Throw you, it can, in the bottom of you your can do purse. this. They're yeah. not going to take this away from you, are they? No, they won't take it away. We'll pass yeah. those through TSA? Yep. <laughs> we'll find out here in a couple weeks when I go on vacation. Oh, Thank you so much. Thank you for Appreciate having me. It. These are excellent suggestions. We'll be right back with our panel of medical experts to talk with them after this break. That's really cool.